What's up everybody, it's your boy Rue, and today we're doing a different type of video. So, the JP Dokkan official Twitter just about an hour ago released the new SA animations for the two LRs of the top legendary summon banner that's going to be coming out for my time in about a day and a half, I believe. So, I did my best to not see any spoilers from other like on YouTube or on other other social media accounts so I could comp come into this completely blind and watch it for the first time with you all. So I actually because I'm new to Twitter I actually did see a little bit of the top video but I'm not going to talk about it because I don't want to ruin it for you guys. So we're just going to start with the second video so what I'm assuming is what we're about to watch is the essays and I did see that because again I scrolled a little bit too far down just to make sure I got everything so I saw like a little bit of the details for one of the units. So I know that one of them for sure has an active skill. So we're about to see multiple animations. Hopefully some new OSTs. Because the OSTs keep getting better and better every time. Just like the animations do. So let's get right into it. Let's not waste any more time. Did y'all just see that? Did are y'all watching what I'm watching right now? Active skill. Active skill. Oh, that's clean. That's nice. That's nice. Hmm. I like that. Let's watch it one more time. Let's watch it one more time. That's zoom in queen. Okay, now this 18 key, yo, this 18 key is insane. It's absolutely insane. Freeze the throwing hands and right. Hold on, dude. Can y'all do y'all see this right here? Are y'all do y are y'all watching this? This frame alone makes it worth, I'm not going to say, well, if, if you spend money on this game, this frame alone is totally worth it. Like, dude, can you, like, look at this detail, bro. His body, like, you could see the individual scratch marks, the golden plated, like, you could actually, it actually pops off the screen. And his facial expression, I love how they, they did it also with the, um, the Fizz transforming Frieza, those changes in the eyebrows and, like, the difference in heights. That small little differences, super nice, super nice. Let's keep going. That little, that little wink right there, I love those. Just like that Vegeta smirk, those little subtleties, makes it just perfect. That sound, that sound effect, also a nice little touch. Nice little touch. And don't even get, dude, the, the, this new OST is banging, bro. It's fire. Heat. Absolute heat. The animations and the OSTs just keep getting better and better every time they release new units. Absolutely insane. パカが足止めに随分と全力を出されたようですね。もし俺が失敗しても、お前がいれば後は大丈夫だと思ったからな。信頼していただけて光栄ですよ。<笑> Yo, that active skill interaction between Frieza and Seventeen is so good, bro. The voice acting was well done. I don't know, like when this comes to the, the global English side of things, it's probably this gonna probably gonna become trash. But on the JP side, that voice acting, absolutely beautifully done. Well done, Dokkan. They actually, they pulled it off again, man. Every single unit that was released in these banners, including like the Vegeta LR, the Goku LR. The two banner units, the Gohan and Piccolo, the Gohan and Frieza. Now this, like you can't, like you can't complain, bro. This is insane. This is absolutely ridiculous. 
Now, this unit right here, the second one, or technically the first one. I know what this unit is because I scrolled down a little bit too far and I saw the uh, card art. And I'm just going to say right now, the card art is wild. Like, it's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. But I haven't seen... The only thing I haven't seen for this card besides the... Uh, so the only thing I have seen for this card is the card art and then the fact it has an active skill. I haven't seen anything else. I have no idea what these animations are about to be. So let's get right into this. I can't believe Dokkan actually did this, bro. I cannot believe they actually did this. Okay. So I'm, this is the, this is the 18 key, 18 key right here. Yo, yo, bro, they they really went all in on 17. They really went all in on MVP 17. They they trying to make that bread. So I cannot. I was talking about this in my uh. The summon video I recorded yesterday. So these video, this video, and then the video I make after this with the details of the two units, because I don't know what they do at all, are probably going to come out before the summoning video did, just because the editing is taking me a little bit of time for that video. But I pretty much get I, one of my ideas was well, not one of my. I'm not going to take credit for it, but ideas I saw around and I kind of agreed that that could have been a possibility was this fight moment right here, because it is a, a representative of 17 themed celebration, but the the I didn't think they'd actually do it, and they actually did it. Dokkan actually did a thing. They did a thing. They went all in on this anniversary. They weren't playing. Any, they weren't playing around. And again, OST for the previous LR and for this LR, nuts, bro. Absolutely nuts. Let's watch it one more time. I want to look at that uh 18 key, cause that 18 key, those couple frames with 17 close up. Oh my goodness. Hold, on, I gotta see that one more time. Hold up, dude. Like, look at his face. Look at this guy's face. Why do they make him such a savage, bro? What is it? When does 17 become such a savage? Oh, I missed it. I missed it. I missed it. Hold on. I, I gotta get this in there. Dude, y'all see this? Look at my man's face, bro. Do not mess with 17. He is he is a savage, bro. Wow. Wow. And I'm, 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 I'm a little bit not surprised, too, at the same time, because he was the MVP. He did win the Tournament of Power. So it also it makes sense that since they highlight uh, Dokkan highlighted Goku and Vegeta and didn't put any 17 in any new units, right? Because Frieza got the combo with the Gohan, Gohan got the combo with both Piccolo and Frieza, and 17 didn't get anything. So you kind of like it was pretty obvious that they were going to release the LRs with 17 some way, one way or another, whether it was standalone or where it was this. One thing I do fa find fascinating about this unit is that the only it's basically a 17 card, right? Both the 12 key and the 18 key was 17, but the active skill was like all of them. So that's pretty dope. So I, I wonder how they named it, because if they named, depending on how they named it, you could run this with other, and you could run this with other 17 units. And then you could also run it with the other, the 17 and the golden freezer, because that's obviously you know, 17 and golden freezer. There's no other unit like that. Let's keep going. <laughs> I love this. This right here is beautiful. The fact they capture this moment like this and the active skill, well done. Well done, Dokkan, well done. No matter how much like we find ways to complain, like there's no way like you could complain about this. Well, besides the fact it's on the LR banner, but I mean like they gotta make money somehow, you know. So, wow, just wow. Wow. 
Hold up, hold up. Oh, I, I didn't go back far enough. I want to just catch that one more time. There's some like really nice frames in these animations that deserve to be paused. Uh, I didn't. I messed up again. Come on, right here. Like you can even tell. Like you can even tell when watching this. Like the detail. Like obviously each character is pretty well detailed. Like Gohan is looking the way they did the shading on the Gohan, the Goku, the Vegeta, and the Frieza is very nice. But it's almost like they gave them a darker shading, kind of like they're in kind of like the background and the main light. The main focus is the 17. I kind of like how they illustrated that a little bit. Boom, this, oh my god. I don't think it's, obviously it's not going to look as clean because the game doesn't have like the as high as resolution. But still, bro. Words cannot describe like how fire these animations are. They really, I, don't, I wonder like, like how do they, how do they get, like where did they go from here, you know? Like, like where did the animations go from here for 2021? Are they just going to keep getting better or... Even if they stay the same, it's still they're still insane. Like it's as good, if not better, than that when the anime came out. Like that's how ridiculous these are. This this the way these this zoom in for these zoom ins for seventeen are my favorite of this entire eighteen super tech eighteen key super. Like, just look at this man's face. Look at the shading. Bro, like, this this right here, these next three seconds. Oh. A1. Dokkan did it, man. They did it. They knew that they needed to deliver this year. Because, well, I'm not going to say the 50 was lackluster, but there was a lot of, like, it could have been a lot better. Let's just put it that way and leave it at that. But this six year anniversary is just I'm at a loss for words. I'm I'm really I'm really at a loss for words. If they if by any, like depending on what that uh summoning ticket those not I'm not gonna call it those special tickets, the rainbow special tickets, because we still don't know what those are, depending on what those turn out to be, and if they in part three, if they release easy A's, if they release an easy A area for all four free to play units and they release an easy A battle for the AGL transforming Vegeta, the AGL blue Vegeta that transforms into Evolution Blue. This anniversary is the greatest anniversary of Gacha games, not even Dokkan, Gacha games of all time. My opinion. There's no, like, like, what do you, like, what, what, what argument can be made against that? You know what I'm saying? Like, this is, this is insane, bro. This is insane. So yeah, those are the animations. As y'all can tell. I'm I am very hyped for these units because the animations are wild and I would love to see them in game going through events. But because on JP I am a free to play player, I will not be I will not be going in at all on these LR banners because it's just asking to get shafted. But hopefully, so in the next video I'm gonna look into the details. Hopefully they're and then this is not even not even just for me, but for all free to play players out there that are not gonna be summoning on this. Let's hope, let's hope to Zeno that that leader skills can be run as a friend as a friendly so at least we could use them some way cuz cuz I'm, I'm i already know like this this right here is probably the chances of this being a joint forces leader is kind of kind of high but it's a 18 and freeze it nothing like that and this obviously i highly doubt they named it 17 there's no way there has to be like 17 and universe 7 or just universe 7 like universe 7 team or something like that so both of these units can be run with other like Frieza units, like it could be run with all the other representative Universe 7 units that came out. So this is this is fire. Jokan did a good job as far as I'm concerned. So those are my thoughts on the animations. What do you guys think? Let me know down in the comment sections below. And that's it for all for this one. Thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed the video. And I'll see you next time. Peace.